Fulton. Like so many others, our love story started with a conversation online. It wasn't a mute cute like in fairy tales, and it wasn't even the date of movies. But that isn't where our love story lies. In fact, it wasn't until our second date that we discovered our chemistry, and not until our third when you finally worked up enough courage to kiss me. It was that kiss, that first dance, that told us that this was different. This relationship was different than those that we had had. Shortly after we started dating, I didn't want to waste my time, and I told you that while dating was fun, what I really wanted, what I really wanted one day was a marriage, a family, and kids. I expected you to be scared, but I'll never forget the look in your eyes when you told me it was your dream too. Both you and I had, been, had both been in relationships where we experienced deep passion, but also deep pain. What lacked was commitment. So while that first date may have lacked in passion, we stand here today in commitment to each other. Because truth is, this is real life and not a movie. And in real life, we have fought. We have cried, we have yelled, we have hurt each other but we have apologized, we have made up and forgiven each other. And most importantly, we have fought for each other and chosen each other. So today, in front of our family, friends, and loved ones, I choose you. I choose you today, tomorrow, and every day for the rest of our lives. Uh, <laughs> Con, never in life did I think I'd find a woman like you. The everything I wanted in a relationship and out of a partner. I often find myself asking, how is it that I've gotten so lucky and found a woman who's beautiful, intelligent, kind, and so compassionate? You make me feel like the luckiest man in the world. I feel extremely blessed to have met you, and I look forward to this life that we have built and continue to build together. There's no doubt in my mind that I'm a better man today because of you. Because when we first met, I was undoubtedly the furthest thing from perfect that you've ever seen. And you still took a chance on me. You showed me what true unconditional love was. You taught me how to compromise and how to listen. So, my dear, on this day, I will admit to you what you've concluded all along. I'm the Reacher. <laughs> and I will spend the rest of my days proving myself worthy of your love. I vow to listen, to speak lovingly, and give all of myself to you for the rest of our lives. And if you be nice to me, I'll let you have the bigger scoop of ice cream. <laughs> Well, if you'll take this ring and repeat after me. <clears throat> Khan, I give you this ring. Khan, I give you this ring. As, as a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And with this ring. And with this ring. I do give you my life. I do give you my life. In Christ's love and strength. In Christ's love and strength. Khan, if you'll place the ring on Colton's finger and repeat after me. Colton. Colton. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And with this ring. And with this ring. I do give you my life. I do give you my life. In Christ's love and strength. In Christ's love and strength. You may now kiss your lovely bride. Ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Mr. and Mrs. Colton Deere.